And hello guys. So some spousal pressure has went out and I am doing episode two. Apparently I'm supposed to go look at this creepy fella who's just staring down this hallway for no reason. Ah, uh, anyway. Yep, here we go. Continue with the nightmare. How am I supposed to get it? Am I supposed to? I can't get around this. Really? I have to go all the way around the other end? <sighs> that was just unnecessary. Do me a favor, Sonny. I could really use a tune right now. Coconut number six in the jukebox. I'd do it myself, but both of my legs have gone to sleep. Bad circulation. Yeah. Are you serious? Coconut again? You disgust me. Call yourself a rocker. Unbelievable. Uh, it does that. Get stuck. Yeah. You need to give it a good solid whack. Now that's what I'm talking about. Yeah. We used to have a jukebox like that at the Pizza Hut. And... This is it. I've done uh, gone to hell. Where I grew up. Let's see. Okay, now this person. Is it a woman or a man? Can't tell. Mm -hmm. Don't go in there, young man. You can hurt yourself in the dark. I think I can handle it, ma'am. I didn't want to wait. I wanted to find stuff to get the key and get out as soon as possible. The waitress was giving me a headache. Overeager fans always did. Oh gosh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die in a men's restroom. Hello? This is not okay. Mr. Stuckey? Carl couldn't make it. Unfortunately, he was taken ill. But I have the key for you and instructions on how to get to the lake. Okay. I wish you a good stay in my cabin. I'll come by later to check how you've settled in. Okay, she looks and like a hag raven. Wife. I insist. Thanks. Okay, she looks a lot less like a hag raven now that I can see all of her all at once. Cauldron Lake is a special place. Very inspiring. Oh, is it? Okay, so when you say Carl was going to time, die, you, can hurt you mean he's actually dead, and that woman killed him, right? And I must remind Sarah to change the Leave the diner. You got it. Already. Even that sounds better than your singing. Are you alright? Splendid! Splendid! Okay, do I... Is there more than I have to... Okay. <laughs> the Andersons, they're, uh, local musicians. We're waiting for Dr. Hartman to come pick them up. <laughs> oh, look, they're gonna be at Cauldron Lake, too. I'll get to hang out with them. Bye, Mr. Rake. Mission accomplished. The key... And the directions. My hero. I got some flashlights. Did you get batteries? Hey, wait! Mrs. Wake! Your... Your keys! What keys did we take? Where are we going? <laughs> oh my gosh. We're gonna die. Can We're gonna you die. this place? This would make a wonderful setting for a book. We're supposed to be on vacation, Alice. Okay, so we're not I'll going it to out when we get back home. Okay? Okay. We can talk about this later. What have you got me into? I didn't want to talk about it. I wanted to bury my head in sand. Keep in mind, my husband is watching me freak out right now. I was a successful writer, but that was a long time ago. I hadn't been able to write a word in two years. Not since my last book. What the heck? 
Diver's Isle. Wow. Oh, this looks cute. This is like something from a I spy right. book or something. Don't worry, honey. I'll get you inside safe and sound before it gets dark. And I've got the flashlight. I know. I'm okay. Alice had a phobia. The fear of darkness. I wanted to make sure we were inside with the lights on before sunset. Yeah, right. Bird leg cabin. Bam. I can see why they call it bird leg. There's a lot of bird legs here. Okay. Here we go. Let's take a look inside. Oh my gosh. This is like my least favorite thing ever. It's dark in there. When I don't know Can you figure out what, on, honey? when to expect that. Oh, that's creepy. I don't know when to expect the bad things to happen. Okay, so where are the lights? Do I have to find like a breaker? Hello? Yes, Anyone I do. Here? I have five batteries. Yay. Oh, gosh. Okay, where's the... <sighs> this is just not okay, guys. Not okay. Where's the power? Do I not have a... What happened to the five batteries that I had? Why do I have the flashlight on? Can I turn it off? The cabin looked like a time capsule from the 60s, or even earlier. July. Is it July? I actually kind of like this cabin, except moment, that the scary that I things. I have seen on the ferry returned. <sighs> yeah, scary things are gonna happen here. Damn. Oh, nice. Uh, okay, where is the, to get the power? power in the cabin. There had to oh, be somewhere on the island. Okay, so it's not in the cabin, like a normal person would put it. I have to search outside too. Okay, well, let's check out here then. Oh, there's a green light. Is that it? No, that's a radio. Okay, nope. That's not where I want to go. Not at all. <sighs> Sorry. The power cable goes to that shed over there. Oh. Thanks for, uh, thanks for mentioning it. Where's, is this the door? This is the door. An old generator had been connected to the power cable. Oh, I died too much. I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing here. Okay. Did I get the power on? Ah. You guys should be so thankful my husband is sitting next to me pointing at the screen periodically, otherwise <laughs> we would have been doing that cycle for a long, long time. <laughs> I win! Like power roulette. The lights are on! Good work, honey. I'll freshen up a bit and start settling in. Okay. I'll look around a bit. What? Sure thing. Have fun. Ooh, I the can see that. Stuff. One... <sighs> it was a beautiful place. I told myself I could rest here, sleep here, and forget about my work. Oh, I thought really we could be happy here. Story. Maybe it would be that again. Maybe. Okay. Where did I go? I got lost. Oh. Hey, light. That's some really bright light. <laughs> Alice? Honey? Alan. 
I'm upstairs. Oh no. You. Shut your eyes, hun. I can only guess what her surprise is. Well, hello there. I'm not the surprise. It's in the study. Go take a look. Oh, there's a study. Is that? Oh. Okay. Ah. Surprise! I'm assuming it's the typewriter. What? what is this? I guess I have a small confession to make. I thought maybe you could write here that a change of scenery would get you past. Dead, Alice, you. Everyone hey, keeps. Hey, hey, hey! Just hear me out! There's a local doctor, Dr. Hartman. I read a book of his. He has a private clinic here. He specializes in helping artists. Maybe so now you want to get me committed? No! It's not like that. That's not. Alan? Alan? Uh, oh, don't! Just don't! I don't want to hear it! God damn it, Alice! God damn it. This I knew not she okay. wouldn't follow me in the dark. I needed some time alone to think things through. <sighs> so she's gonna die. And I'm gonna die. Everyone's gonna die. I would not survive in any kind of situation. It would just be bad. Damn it. I would just hold my arms out and be like, take me now. I can't take it. Alice? All the lights were out. Alice! Alice! Where are you? Help! Alice! I'm coming! Yeah. Ah. I'm coming! No! What the hell? What? Ah, what is going on? I don't like bird leg cabin. All those bird legs hurt. No! No! Alice! Ah. Alice! Please, please, please. I don't know what I'm begging for, I just... Oh no! <gasps> At least we're all dying quickly. Keep going, Alice. <gasps> Way to go. Alice? Waking up in the crash, oh, look, my mom felt like I had woken from one That's nightmare just... and entered another. I couldn't remember no, really how I got there. All I knew was that something terrible had happened to Alice. The phone was dead. I'd have to find help on foot. And here we are. This is not okay. This is not okay. Oh, look. That looks like my underwear. Among Alice's things was a book, The Creator's Dilemma, by a Dr. Emile Hartman. Seeing the book brought back my fight with Alice. I didn't like it, and I didn't like the guy's smug face on the cover either. Uh, okay. So, I assume I go this direction? The gas station was my best bet. They'd have a phone I could use. It looked like a long hike through the forest to get there. Um, how about you just grow wings and fly? Uh, that's probably not my best bet. Damn. Uh, I don't, what was that? So, our wife is not dead, is that right? Hello? Man, go away! You just bring Hello? bad things. Someone there? Those pages of your book? The loose sheets of paper were pages from a manuscript entitled Departure. That was the name I planned to use for the next novel I had never gotten started. I was named the author. I hadn't written it. I couldn't remember writing it. In the scene on the page, the hero was attacked by an axe murderer in the woods at night. Okay, so I should check F5. I wonder... 
Well, that's not going to mess with any of my recording settings. <laughs> okay, I don't think it did. The title Departure page is a manuscript. The man turned to face me. His face was covered in shadows. It was hard to make him out in the darkness of the forest that surrounded us, but the axe he lifted was plain to see. It glistened with the blood of his victim. He grinned madly. The shadows were alive, distorting his features. It was a scene from a nightmare, but I was awake. Not with that little symbol. Okay. How close to the gas station am I? How close are the scary things? Anybody there? Please, I've been in an accident. Jesus. The lights up ahead were a good sign. Maybe I wouldn't have to hike all the way down to the gas station to find a phone. No, I think you probably should. Uh, what's all this? Is that not stuff I can pick up? Where am I supposed to go? That way? Sorry. <sighs> oh. Really? That looks awful. Uh, that's... I don't... Are you sure? Ah. I... Anybody there? feel like that was Please. a dumb plan. I've been in an accident! Hey! Hey, <gasps> you! Phil! There's been an accident! I need help! Miss Hossett, I need to... Cabins for rent in oh, oh hell. Carl Stucky. Please to meet you. non reservation has required. Fair and square. Where is he? Uh where is help? Okay, that person is dead. Why am I not heading towards the help? Uh... No, I won't. Stucky would be knocking on the door with his axe like oh Nicholson in The Shining. Oh look, guns. We like guns. Guns are... Ah! Batteries! This is not okay. I need batteries. I need all the batteries. During your... I don't want to leave, Crying. but I don't think I should stay. Okay, I can't leave. Like that. In testimony proven. I suppose I got this start. I wasn't about to open the door as long as I was liable to catch an axe with my forehead. Okay, am I supposed to go out the window? And keep those. Ah, there's a phone. Yes. Right fall sheriff station. Tell me I Hello? Hello? It's maddening. And it's not okay.
am I supposed to do? Oh, and get out of Okay, so that whole wow, that was quite a boat bulldozer. The bulldozer had gone over the cliff with the office. I hoped Stucky had suffered the same fate, but I wasn't planning on staying to find out. Okay. Was that there before? I don't think that gate was open before. Kill someone or something. There were no bodies. They just disappeared. If I was dreaming, it felt real uh, nice. Where, where do I go? What? Oh, okay. Am I supposed to shoot it or just turn it off? Kick. Alright. Neither. I don't shoot it or The dark turn it forest off. was the last place I wanted to go, but I had no choice. I had to get to the gas station. Ah. Yeah, I'm out of ammo. So, what do I do now? are just peering out of nowhere. When I saw the river below, something uncoiled itself inside my head. I realized that I'd have to find a way across. I didn't even want to look at the water. Okay. Let's go this Actually, it would be a pretty fun game if it didn't have the creepy phantoms appearing out of nowhere ready to kill me. Oh man. I don't have any ammo. I'm gonna die, aren't I? Stucky was still out there, in the dark, stalking me. Why is he stalking me? Is it because I didn't take the keys from him? I don't, I don't have any ammo. I don't have any ammo. Is that ammo right there? I don't know. I don't know what to do. I I, I guess I should just run, right? I'm gonna die. That's it. I'm gonna die. I'm trying, but I died. Can I be done? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna be done for right now. I die. I, I'm sorry. Yes, I know. I understand. But I'm gonna be done because I can't take it right now. <laughs> Every single muscle in my body is on edge. Okay. I will see you guys at some later date when I have recovered from my trauma of this game. I guess I'll continue playing it because it probably is pretty funny. Um, also, I'm really not very good at it. So, yeah. Bye.